Another iconic polo shirt? Well, another replica. Due to its demand and the popularity, so many replicas on online marketplaces. But this polo is not easy to copy. The embroidered crocodile logo requires over 1200 stitches. So on this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to spot a replica Lacoste polo shirt. Let's go! So guys, before getting to the video, I bought this fake polo off eBay for $59.99. Yes, for $59.99 for fake Lacoste polo. Check the description out. It says signature design from Lacoste, but it is not. It is poor quality fake. Beware of fakes on eBay. If you are a first time buyer, now let's see how you can spot a replica if you are buying one. First up, you can spot a replica by checking the packaging. On my left, I got the genuine polo that I bought from Lacoste website. They use shirt folding boards when packing their polos, so it maintain a perfectly uniform fold. Also, the outer packaging of the polo is in high quality. It is 100% recycled polythene bag, which contains a high quality print too. However, on the fake polo shirt, just come in a polythene bag. It is folded without a folding board, so it is wrinkled and creased. Also, used a cheap quality polythene bag. This is mainly to keep the cost down. So guys, next up, check the material. Lacoste genuine classic polo shirt made out of cotton petit PK. A fabric made with multiple threads for a textured feel that gives you the comfort. Feels very nice on the skin. You can feel its quality. But on the fake polo, the fabric feels thinner and low of quality. It doesn't have that nice feel on the skin that the genuine polo does. Next up, you can check the collar. Lacoste Classic L12 Polo comes with ripped collar, which stretches out and go back to the original size, keeping a well-fitted look. Feels thicker due to its texture. However, the fake polo collar looks ripped but not sure about the fabric as it is soft and thin. It doesn't feel like a ripped collar. Also, fake polo collar is bigger than the genuine. Not really sure why they used an oversized collar on the fake. Same time, have a look at the back of the collar too. You can see the difference. The fake polo collar has gone below the polo collar hem. And again, genuine Lacoste polo shirt comes with ripped cuffs. So the sleeve fitted nicely in arms. However, as you can see, the fake polo doesn't have proper ripped cuffs. They just flat out. Don't see any kind of stretch on cuffs. Next up guys, you can check the color label. This fake polo shirt is a very good replica. Very identical, but the quality is way apart. When looking at the label, you can clearly see they just tried to copy it, but couldn't match the quality. The print, letter sizing and the fonts are wrong. Also the crocodile on the label comes smaller in the fake polo. Moving on to the embroidered crocodile logo. According to Lacoste, it requires over 1200 stitches. To be honest, without a closer look, you cannot spot any differences in this fake croc. So, look carefully on the crocodile tail, then the legs of the crocodile, lower jaw, upper jaw, and the teeth, center body of the crocodile. Mainly the logo on the fake comes shorter. Same time, check the back of the crocodile logo. As you can see, quality of finishing touches on the fake polo is very poor. Visible loose threadings and not neat. Another way of spotting a replica by checking the buttons. Lacoste L12 L12 polo comes with mother of pearl buttons. But bear in mind only classic come with pearl buttons. On this fake polo has plastic buttons. You can check the mother of pearl buttons as they are slightly cooler in room temperature or if you touch them to the bottom of your lip, they are much cooler than plastic. Also, check for the buttonholes. Genuine Lacoste Polo comes with nicely stitched buttonholes, neat and tidy. But on the fake polo, buttonholes looks messy, not neat. Another way of spotting a replica by checking the side slit. As you can see, the slide slit on the fake polo way bigger than the genuine, widely open. I think it is not easy to copy the Lacoste slide slate as it is time consuming. So they have chosen the easy option. Next up, look for the inner polar construction and seams. Have a look at the shoulder seam for an example. On the fake polo, they just copied it, but there is no strength or quality. 
it is soft and floppy, whereas the genuine Polo seam feels hard and durable. Last up, check the wash labels. When comparing the labels on both Polos, the material quality, print quality is way higher on the genuine Lacoste Polo, whereas the fake Polo looks cheap and low of quality. So guys, I hope this information will help you and useful. If you ever to buy a Lacoste Polo shirt, you will know what to look out for. So guys, as always, thanks for watching. Hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you are new around here. I'll see you next time.